its teacher Courtney. This is part three of Scholar's Public Speaking and Debating Competition. In this video, I will be discussing the rules of the competition as well as tips and tricks on how to get high scores with the judges. So, grab your pen, grab your piece of paper, take notes, and let's begin. Round two of our competition is divided into two parts. Part number one is where each candidate will be asked three questions by the judges. The candidate has then got 30 seconds to answer those questions. Part number two is where the judge will present a topic to the candidate. Candidate has then got two minutes to prepare your speech and two minutes to present your speech. Please take note. You need a piece of pa paper and a pen close by to make notes for the preparation of your speech. Here are the rules. Rule number one. When speaking during your debate, speak directly to the scholar teacher, which is me. Rule number two. During the debate live session, sit in a quiet room with a neat background. I don't want to see people walking behind you or sitting next to you. This is distracting. Rule number three. If possible, please wear headphones with a mic so that we can hear you. Rule number four. Candidates need their own piece of paper and pen to make notes for their speech. Tips on how to get a high score. Tip number one. When asked a question, answer in a full, fluent sentence. For example, what is your favorite food? Hmm, my favorite food is chicken, not chicken. Mm-mm, no. Tip number two, include examples in your given topic as I just showed you. If your topic is, what is your favorite food? Tell us, what is your favorite food? What do you eat it with? I eat chicken with noodles. I eat chicken with rice. I eat chicken with vegetables. Ooh, tip, sorry, tip number three, <laughs> quick thinking. You must be able to answer your questions very fast. You are on a time limit. Tip number four. Know how much time you are allowed to prepare your speech and to present your speech. And tip number five. Your attitude. Did you notice how I made a mistake during this video? Did you notice how I apologized? I laughed and I continued. That's a positive attitude during public speaking. If you make a mistake, that's fine. Laugh. Apologize. Carry on. Smile. Greet the judges. Make sure you are neatly dressed. And we can't wait to meet you. I'm so excited. I'll see you all very soon. Bye.